Hey guys, this is Nisa from the NF Imagination and today we're going to talk about one of our finished projects, Fallout Wasteland. So here in this project we have six minis and they are from the Fallout Wasteland and they are all painted on level 5 and now we're gonna take a look at them and how we approach them. So the thing is that I've talked already a lot about the Fallout Wasteland in our previous videos because it's quite popular recently actually I would say and we painted a lot of them and we really like painting them so I'm not gonna really talk about the Fallout Wasteland because we have it <laughs> and I can also actually drop the link here and so you can check it out also and um, except that to just to give a little information this is an RPG game and there's like um, you making the packs and saving the world and it goes like that so um, in here we have um, three types of different minis and uh, actually the similarity is like two of them, uh, four of them in this case are actually in the um, power armor and one of them are like enclave soldiers and the other one enclave tasteless soldiers in the power armor, both of them and we got two survivors and like I said this is on the level 5 and this has been created based on a reference really that actually our client sent it to us and he wanted something like um, black but uh, like showing a little bit of metal and like a little bit of edge lining and all sort of stuff and he wanted us to change the for example uh, the green uh, spots or like green um, flashes let's say with the orange ones that he thought it would more pop up in the um, in the color scheme so with a uh, room with roll to it basically and this is how it went as you can see we have some really cool uh, details here on like no metallic metals we have like really cool weathering effects i think the minis are already really cool itself i think the orange uh, spots was really good idea i like the hazard lines details also the weapons for example especially picked by our client that he wanted specific weapons in the speci specific minis really so we've rolled with it and um, what else I can say, like I said, there's already three types of minis and there's the Enclave Tessa soldiers and the, um, there's a, I'm sorry, there's the Enclave soldiers and Enclave Tessa soldiers and the survivor and two of each basically. And I think it went really cool. Oh, additional information by the way, because normally, you know, they have the specific poses, like the classical poses, but like our client in this case wanted us to specifically have them in the different poses with the legs and the arms and everything, so it would look like more dynamic and more like ongoing on the battle. And I think it's a great idea, by the way. And so they actually um, rolled <laughs> with what he wanted. And so as you can see, they have all different poses and they are like really dynamic. I really like how it turned out. So this is it from this project guys, I hope you liked the video, if you liked it don't forget to smash the like button and let us know in the comment section what you think of it. And if you want to see the full pictures of the um, full army, this is the full army though, but if you want to see the full quality pictures, you can always go to our website www.denfimagination.com and check the full pictures from there. Thank you for watching us, see you in the next one, bye bye.